Wasted food is a big problem in the U.S. It's estimated that we waste between 31 and 40 percent of all food that we produce. We want to look at lost nutrients because we're throwing away a tremendous amount of good, healthy food. And when we look at calories, which is what had been looked at previously, we don't necessarily get to that because some of the most important foods for people to eat are relatively low in calories. So looking at items like vitamin D or fiber really help get a picture of the foods that we need to consume more of that are going right into the landfill. What we found is that wasted food in the United States contains a staggering amount of nutrients, and especially nutrients that we tend to underconsume in the United States. If we wanted to use dietary fiber as just one example, if we look at all the food that we waste on any given day across the nation, that food contains an average of about six grams of fiber per person per day. And to put that into context, the recommended intake for fiber for an adult woman is 25 grams. The amount of fiber that we're wasting each day as a nation is equal to that recommended intake for 74 million women. To conduct this study, we use two data sources, both from the USDA. Our process is that we created a code book to link these two data sources together, and then we performed a series of calculations that allowed us to estimate the amount of loss by each nutrient. The magnitude of food that's wasted in the United States is, is vast. And sometimes it's useful to help communicate that to people to, to do some kind of comparison to types of information that they already understand. And so we thought, let's take a look at the nutritional content of the food that's wasted. That, that communicates to nutritionists. It communicates to a lot of people. when We think about the fact that we are under consuming so many nutrients, and yet we're putting those same nutrients right into the landfill.